but he's hunkering down good. You know what? We do have our tear gas just for this very reason. Let's see if we can toss one right over that rock there. That probably just flew off into the wilderness. Man, it's going to be one of these. We're going to have about a six mile hike back to the vehicle, aren't we? Oh, nice. He tackled him. Good job there, dude. Right, dude, good job over there. He just straight up tackled him. That was nice. We've already lost him. I know we could probably just keep smashing down this way, but yeah, I barely touched the, the steering wheel there. And wow, let's see if we can set a record. Hello everybody, Matthew Street. We're back with some more LSPDFR. We're going to do something a little different today. We're going to have some fun. Uh, first off, I got a new car pack. Came with a lot of vehicles, including the Silverado. I know it says Los Santos, but, you know, hey, whatever. It's kind of cool. Um, and I am wearing a Blaine County uniform. We can actually switch that to a uh, Park Ranger, so I may do that in a second because we're going to do some wilderness calls. I've never actually played with those, so it should actually be kind of fun, as I see. That's kind of ominous. We've got a, a mount line just up there staring at us. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Go into the park ranger there we go so we're gonna go ahead and do that today now uh, i don't have these set to automatically spawn in so we're just gonna do uh calls off and then we'll just call for calls and already we got something <laughs> that wasn't exactly what i was looking for um let's see here if i can remember yeah here's my key to get there um i want to well vet's not gonna do anything is it uh i don't really just want to kill this thing right off the bat so let's see if just stunning it will make it go away but i figured we kind of cruise up in this area and see what we can do calls wise he's not gonna go away is he um you know what let's see if we can call animal services in real quick i don't know if i actually have it on here nope i sure don't that's no big deal though um so Okay, good. Just run away. I don't want to have to deal with you. <laughs> kind of creepy, but cool. Right off the bat. All right, so uh, yeah, we're just going to call some things in because, again, I don't have these uh, set to actually auto give me calls. So uh, I will kind of head up a little bit towards this wilderness area, and then we'll call something in. There's that same mountain lion. <laughs> go on, bud. Go on. I don't want anything to do with you. So uh, I'm going to get us someplace where we've got one. Only thing is, I get a little bit of texture loss with this new vehicle pack, so I may be adjusting that. But at any rate, uh, you can find this pack in the description as normal. And I'm going to uh, just go ahead and get us on a call. We'll just go right here. So I don't know where any of these spawn in or what they do. So uh, that's all right, though. Oh, wrong one. We want to go to the callout manager. We'll go to our wilderness. Uh, what do we want to do? Let's talk about a aircraft crash. That sounds fun. All units, assistance required, an airplane crash, and not Chiliad. Okay, well, we are going to clear, oh goodness, yeah, there was a crash, wasn't there? Well, we're going to head towards that real quick. Not sure how far away it is, I don't think it's too far. Watch out there, police bike. Uh, that pack also had some bikes in it, that's why that was a different one. Well, let's see if we can't head over here and see what we've got going on. One of these days I'm going to do this properly, I'll actually get a uh, park ranger vehicle and uh we'll do it that way but in the meantime just figure it'd be fun mix it up just a little bit not have to go crazy with uh, a bunch of shooters and all that we may who knows it, things can get crazy in the wilderness so we're almost on scene we've got a crash here we heard it explode and there's plenty of people going down the road as if nothing just happened but okay <laughs> gotta love the feds don't we okay they're sure no oh god you can stop now okay 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 we need to shut traffic down yeah, just plow right through it, you moron. Okay, well, good thing is we've already got... Oh, God. Already got fire and ambulance coming. Um, they just ran over somebody. Oh, this is going to be awful. <laughs> We're about to have multiple vehicles explode here, and I don't know why you're walking up with a gun, man. It was just a... Uh, I mean, it was horrible, but it was an accident. There wasn't any sort of uh, <laughs> respond to a shooter. Although they may be shooting out of this helicopter. Look at that. Got some serious ammo. Let's make sure we get this all cut out. I think the fire is good. I really wish that ambulance would leave and get that uh, siren right out of our ears. But, um, well, okay. Not really a whole lot to do on this call, I guess. Just going to see if I can search the vehicle. And all that's happening is uh, havoc. So... We're gonna go ahead and put that fire extinguisher away. And you know what? We're gonna go ahead and uh, hit that uh, left control Y and say it's good. We're just gonna get out of here. <laughs> Cause that's a little hectic. Well, don't know what happened there. There were no bodies or anything, but oh well, it happens. So let's go ahead and stay just a little bit down the road here. Kinda heading uh, towards the grape seed area, aren't we? 
don't want to get too far out of the wilderness. I think actually what I want to do, I know a spot where I want to go, so I'm going to go ahead and turn around, go back towards the mayhem, and uh, we're going to get on a little trail there, some good wilderness stuff. So I'm going to head over there, and I'll bring you back here in just a second. All right, so uh, we just hopped down on the map just a little bit. This is the area I figured would be kind of cool, up here by this river and all that. I don't know why I got a radar on. There's no need for that, is there? So uh, let's just go ahead and kind of get ourselves uh, let's prep for a little bit better spot. We don't have to take 10 seconds just to take off. Not really a lot of good stopping areas, though, are there? Let's just go ahead and see what else we want to call ourselves in for. Back into that wilderness call outs. Um, rocks blocking. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. That should be fun. We have a oh, right here in front of us. In Isn't that convenient? Canyon. Units respond code 2. Code 2, all right. Don't need to do any uh, code 3 action here. Just lights are fine. Not that we expect any traffic. Okay, yep, there are the rocks. So uh, we need to call us a truck in. We've already got one, so I'm not sure exactly what kind of truck is going to be so different, but let's check and see. We're requesting a truck to remove the rocks. Affirmative truck in route. Okay, well, I want to get out of the way, as Lord knows where they're going to be coming from. So, uh, yeah, let's see here. Now, one thing that is cool is I know that we've got the air ambulance option here within the actual callouts itself. We can do some hunting license check and fishing license check. So we may head to, to an area where we find people fishing and check some licenses. That'd be kind of cool. Don't know if this truck is coming or not. Let me just go ahead and try that again. Nope, they should already be here, I guess. So let's see here. Maybe we can move them? Okay, well... Uh, I think they parked up on top, and that dude just, oh, yep, that's what happened, and he just fell. <laughs> okay, I guess you're okay there, man. This may just be a wilderness bloopers. Uh, in honesty, I normally like to try things before I just uh, pop in here and record a video and upload it. Uh, that way, it, it kind of goes smooth, but these are ones I've never done anything with, so uh, this may just end up being a blooper, and uh, all ironic uh, blocking the road, or code four. Okay, cool. But yeah, so I may practice this some more offline and then get us a more proper episode. But hey, if anything, it's comical so far. Uh, that was interesting. Good job there, man. Now, good luck getting out of here. We may be calling in a tow truck for him. Well, uh, the car won't even start. I guess that's what happens when it falls off a cliff, right? You need some help there, man? Hey, sir. You're going to flood it. Stop. Okay, whatever. Let's just see if we can tow it. Nope, no option there. Dude, it's not going to happen. For real. Just stop. Just get out for me. Alright, just hang out right here. Let me see if I can tow this for you. I can. Awesome. Now, you. I'm going to get you right out of here, okay? <laughs> Let's just get him. Yeah, let's send an Uber up here. See how that works. Sorry, dude. You broke your stuff. I mean, look at it. Everything's busted. There's your tow truck. There's the Uber behind it. So, we're going to get you out of here, man. You need to get to hell. If anything, we should have done an ambulance. You just fell off a pretty large cliff, so don't hit my truck. That was close. Oh, they're going to hit it anyway, aren't they? All right, your Uber's here. Good job. Oh, man. Well, we're going to have to do our after-action report for the uh, vehicle, of course, and I'm thinking we're going to have quite a bit of damage here in a second. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I, I knew calling an Uber would be uh, super non-legit up here, but uh, the tow truck, I figure, could handle it. Clearly not. See if he can get life figured out. You know what? We'll just say he did. We're going to head on down this way. Might jump over to the other side because I know you can do that. And then we'll go ahead and get us another call in. But yeah, these are fun for sure. I'll have to go through and try all of these at some point or another. And like I said, we can come back and do a proper episode. But you could just kind of mix it up a little bit. Get out of the way, Cody. We're crossing right here. Actually, we'll just chill right here on the bridge. Kind of cool looking, isn't it? I think that's going to have to come back and be a screenshot worthy moment right there. Could be our thumbnail. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and get that call manager out. Go back to the wilderness call. So, uh, you know, let's go ahead and do uh, illegal hunting. That sounds fun. We've got unauthorized hunting in Raptown Canyon. Units respond code 2. Yeah, we're going to respond. Um, see green dots running everywhere. I believe that's the animals. Maybe they are trying to hunt down. Well, okay, well, nope, that could be the guys. Um, okay. Uh, that just is so disconcerting, a guy just running like that. Oh, man, I don't need a flare gun. 
It's actually good to have as a park ranger. Hey, hey, hey! Good lord! Oh my god, I'm glad I was beat right on his head. Because, man, he was... He just fur, he just turned and fired after us. Alright, securing the weapon. Oh, man. Dispatch, I'm going to need an ambulance out here. I, I don't know that. You know what? We're not even going to worry about an ambulance. We're just going to search this guy. I do see we got a little icon on our map over there, so I need to address that. I don't know if it's an animal. Oops, going to push him into the river. Not trying to dispose of evidence here. This was legit. Um, but, yeah, so we may have to go check that out here in a second. But I'm going to go ahead and search this guy's body. Again, if we can uh, keep them on shore and not get swept away. <laughs> and then we'll get a coroner out here. Let's see what we got. A Playboy magazine and a clown mask. While we're here, we'll go ahead and look up Mr. Clint Compton. His uh, record shows a license of, uh, suspended, but no big deal. He wasn't driving. Nothing else, really. A parking ticket, pretty much. Okay. Well, you weren't supposed to be out here hunting. Um... But instead, you uh, you also, when we stop, you decide just to try to fire at us. Backup required. Goodness, that'll wake you up. Creek. Okay, well, their corner is right there, so we're just going to go ahead and back up off the uh, the path, and we're going to go chase down that other symbol here. Uh, I say we are. What's our best route to get there? It may be actually going back the other way. Yep, that's going to be the case, so we're going to go ahead and give that a shot. Corner's got him taken care of. So, no ticket or anything. I was hoping we could get a citation today for, you know, something like that. Poaching, basically. But, no. Nah. Win some, lose some. But, then again, day's not over yet. Yeah, we know he's shot by a handgun. I got him right in the head. <laughs> Don't pull a gun on me, dang it. So, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, head over this direction. Yep, I guess if we're going to duke boys in a vehicle, uh, this can handle it, but still don't want to. So, yeah, I'm going to get us over there closer to that icon, and I will pull you back in here in a second. Well, that wasn't supposed to happen, but I figure this is going to be a little bit of a blooper. Might as well show you. <laughs> I was trying to hot dog a little bit, and uh, there you go. But it actually does handle really well on dirt. Anyway, back to it. See you in a second. All right, we are about on scene. This is a fun little trail to come up here on and uh, just play. I haven't really done that much in just regular GTA. I did a little bit, but not much. But now that we have a purpose to come up here, we will probably be hanging out in this area more. So, uh, I hear a plane. I know they do always fly through here, so that's kind of cool. Right here in the canyon. There you go. It's pretty awesome. Anyway, I guess we got something to do, don't we? Let's check this out. Okay, so this is... Okay. Okay, well... Uh, we got Trevor. Isn't that neat? I kind of expect him to do illegal stuff. <laughs> so, Trevor makes an appearance in LSPDFR. There you go. Uh, knowing who he is, I don't really want to jack with this too much. I mean, I do, but uh, I want some backup. But, you know, it's not legit for a backup of police to come up here. So, uh, yeah, you're kind of in a precarious position there, Trevor. So, uh, do me a favor, man. Look at that. You made me pull out my gun. Uh, honestly, if you'd have bet me a million dollars who would not have gone peacefully, it would have been this guy, not the other. <laughs> so, uh, how do I even get to you to give you in cuffs, man? Okay. Oh, yep. See, that's what I was scared of. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Oh, man, I'm not going to be able to make it back up here, am I? Oh, maybe I can. Wasn't that neat? Okay, let's see if I can just... Nope, 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 nope. Okay, blooper, blooper, blooper. I'm just afraid it's about to happen big time. Yep, okay, here we go. Down the mountain. Here we go. <laughs> okay, I'm going to work on getting back up there somehow. And uh, I'll pull you back in in a second. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, I got up here, oh, and uh, it is letting me arrest him. Ass, we'll see how well this li- Yeah, okay, there we go. <laughs> oh, this is just lovely. Okay, um, I'm thinking I'm going to uh, have to end this call. Oh, cool, actually, we got down here somehow. Okay, let me work back up there again. I'll see you in a second. <laughs> Alright, we made it. Let's see if we can grab him now. Uh... <laughs> This is honestly, Trevor, what are you doing to me? Let's grab him. Hopefully we don't go both flying through the map this time. Okay, we can come back here. <laughs> Gotta kill the suspect. Oh, this is good times. Alright, uh, okay, one more time. Let's see if I can work myself up there. Bring you in here in a second. How do we do this? Okay, we're back. Uh, that one I did a little bit illegitimately. Uh, the other times I was able to work myself back up here. 
Uh, but this time I had him with me. So I just went in and teleported up here, to be honest with you. But, okay. We'll go ahead and uh, release him. Now it says I can ask for the hunting license. He's already in cuffs. We'll see how this goes. So, uh, sir, if I may, go and get that hunting license, Show please, sir. Some ID. Do you have any hunting license? I have it here. Okay, cool. Thank you, Hunter. Okay, cool. Um, we'll just go ahead and say that he gave it to us. Uh, and I want to go ahead and pat him down. I do have him in cuffs, but I need to get that ID. We know who this is, but I'm sure he'll have a different name in the uh, system. So, we'll probably find... Okay, weed, cocaine, and a cigar. That sounds about Trevorish, doesn't it? Yep, oh, it actually is him. Okay. Oh, did you know? His birthday is October 25th, 1981. Never would have guessed it. Okay, cool. So, there we go. Let's go ahead and pull out the tablet. We get to uh, get Trevor Phillips here, so that should be fun. Man, I just want to tack a bunch of stuff on just because we know his past. But then again, he's probably my favorite character in the game. We do need to search his vehicle, too. Uh, so, he has an expired driver's license. Let's see if it is his vehicle. Uh, if it is, and we're going to say he drove it up here. If it is not his vehicle, maybe it was that other individual that was here that we already got. And if that's the case, then uh, we will say he wasn't driving it. But we know what this looks like, so uh, nothing illegal. Let's go ahead and obtain that plate number real quick. That way we can go ahead and run the vehicle. So, all right, let's get that tablet back out once more. Go ahead and look at it. And that is to Miss Kate Johnson. Okay, well, there we go. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, even though it looks like a vehicle, I've seen that individual driving before. So, expired driver's license. We're going to go ahead and get him for a citation on that. If it wasn't him, courts can figure that out. Uh, his record is pretty clean. Uh, Got to admit, that's kind of shocking to me. So... Okay, let's create citations here and an arrest report. So I'm going to get that done. I'll bring you back here in a second when we've got the charges up. All right, welcome back. So here are the charges we got him for. We got him for an expired driver's license, more than 30 days. As you see, it's actually 198 days. Failure to signal, or excuse me, not failure to signal. Those are other charges. Uh, the uh, possession of marijuana and cocaine. I got him for disorderly conduct. There isn't anything for hunting that I can find other than... Uh, hunting an endangered species. There is an animal cruelty, and he did take down an animal, but we're just going to go with disorderly conduct. That'll work. So we're going to go ahead and uh, get him a transport. We'll see how well that goes up here. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, get this towed out of here. We saw the tow truck already, so it wasn't terrible, but he was having a difficult time getting out of here. Almost ruined our own truck. Uh, okay. There you go. Cool. Right in uh, Blaine County Sheriff to come get him. That's appropriate. Uh, I need to move this. This is going to get ugly quickly. Oh, God. Yep, see, there we go. I know I already did some damage in my roll over there, but uh, he's not helping matters. Okay, so they're getting them out of here. That's good. All right, cool. So I'm going to let him take them out, out and then uh, we're going to find us another location, and I will bring you back in. We'll get us one more call, and then we'll call an episode. Okay, welcome back, everybody. I got us moved a little bit out of the area. Just figure... Uh, try something a little bit different here. Let's go back to the menu. I was going to try a few of these, but I guess they aren't loaded in possible, uh, possibly. So we're going to go with, let's try public disturbance, see what that's all about. Um, oh goodness. Yeah, that is a disturbance. That dude's got a gun. Um, I, I, I need backup out here. I do. Um, I guess code three will work. We got a couple units. Okay, let's see what we got going on here. Watch out. Yep. I know. Just stop right there. Stop right there. Stop right there. I don't know what he's aiming at. This may not be illegal after all, but I do need him to drop that weapon. Sir, hands up. Drop the weapon. Drop the weapon. Drop the weapon. Drop the weapon. Thank you. I'm going to secure this weapon, then we'll try to figure out what's going on up there. Okay, weapon secure. God. <laughs> Thanks, homie. Appreciate that. Um, all right. Well, that hurt like hell. Now we got a fractured femur. Um, <laughs> well, this is a fitting episode for it to go in, isn't it? Everything else is kind of going haywire. So, uh, yeah, sir, let me get you in cuffs. I'm glad my backup just fell. Okay, I was going to say, finally, were you the ones that hit me? Probably. I only called for two units. I don't know why there's 1,700 of you, but okay. <laughs> yeah, cars, there's stuff going on here, so y'all just hang on. Let's get this guy moved off the side of the road. I don't want him coming and hitting anybody. We've got enough officers doing that for us right now, don't we? So let's go ahead and release him. Um, oh, come on, guys. Yeah, just get traffic out of here. I'm going to go ahead and actually dismiss these people because they're just going to get in the way. So uh, I don't, I'm trying to figure out what he was looking at up here, what the game was be, uh, the gun was aimed at. Now we're going to sit here and play Demolition Derby. Cool. Uh, so 
Let's just uh, let's just search this guy real, or just ask him a couple questions first. Uh, you know, hey, what what are you doing, man? Why do I care? Because you're out here in the middle of the road with a gun. That's why I care. Where are you headed to? Your friend's home. Well, where'd you come from? Probably home. Yep, that's what I thought. Uh, have you been drinking or anything? Maybe even drugs? Nothing to drink, huh? No drugs? Okay, well, uh, let me go ahead and just pat you down real quick. I've got your weapon. We'll make sure everything comes back cool and clear with you, and if it does, we'll get you out of here in no time. Just be a little patient, unlike our officer. Okay. Let's see here. So he's got nothing on him. That's good. All right, I'll be right back with you, sir. Let me uh, figure out who this guy is and what is going on. It is a disturbance, but, I mean, he really wasn't doing anything other than just aiming a weapon. So let's see. We got Alex Street. Hey, my name makes a, uh, an appearance. There you go. So he doesn't have a driver's license because it's suspended, but who cares? Uh, he doesn't have a gun permit. Now, again, how I'm playing it, if you don't have a gun permit, you can't have any gun. Even though I know in a lot of places, including where I live... Uh, some guns you don't need a permit on, including like a rifle. So, uh, But at any rate, we're going to go ahead and give him an arrest report for property of an illegal firearm. So there we go. He's not a felon that I saw. Let's verify that. Yep, no felonies on his record. So uh, that'll work. Okay, cool. That's kind of neat how the camera just followed that very dirty Tahoe. So uh, we'll just go ahead and get him back to the station. We're going to call this an episode. So I'm going to go ahead and drive him myself. And uh, we'll get down there here in just a second. So uh, we'll pull you in when we are about to look at our after-action report for the vehicle, as well as all of the court cases. See you in a second. Yeah. Well, we're back at the station. I guess Franklin met us here. He may be here to bail out uh, Trevor. We'll see. Let's go ahead and get this guy escorted. Well, you know what? I don't think I've ever shown you all this. We'll do it ourselves. We're going to go put this guy in a cell in the whole nine yards. So let's go ahead and uh, grab him. There we go. Could just have him follow, but I'd rather just grab him. We are in uh, custody here. Hey, what's up, officer? So let's go ahead and uh, pick a cell of our choosing. We'll just go right in the middle. Why not? There you go. So get you in there. We're going to go ahead and release him. Go ahead and get him out of cuffs. Uh, we're just going to tell him to stay here. Obviously, we don't just need him running away on us, do we? So, all right, sir. Well, uh, you'll have a court case here soon. They'll get you taken care of. Thank you. Make sure that door shuts. Kind of slowly but surely. All right, there we go. All right, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and get back out of the station, and we'll bring up those court cases. All right, so that's all there is to it, but it is kind of cool to do that. So uh, first off, let's get this in the sun where we can see it. Somehow, I didn't take a lot of damage from that rollover, and I never fixed a car or anything. I don't do that unless we absolutely have to, like because we lose a tire, and it's just 100% undrivable. But let's go ahead and check it out and see. So, uh, looks pretty good. In all honesty, it shouldn't really have much damage other than our rollover, which is our own stupid fault, wasn't it? Got a little dirty. And then I guess this uh, rear right end could have a little bit of damage. It looks like it does. May just be the texture of the car, too. But, um, I, well, no, I think it looks pretty clean, actually. But it was actually because uh, that tow truck ran into us or knocked something else into it. I think the Uber actually knocked the tow truck into it. Whatever it was, it happened. So let's go and get that tablet out. We'll check out our court cases here. So what do we have? We'll start with Alex Street. That last one we just got. All he had was illegal possession of firearms, so that's going to give him six months in prison and $620. Okay. Mr. Trevor Phillips. Let's go with that guy. Disorderly conduct, what we're calling the uh, uh, hunting without a license, a poaching, or not without a license, but just illegal hunting. So, um, there we go, $643 fine, that's about right. Let's see here, expired driver's license, again, just a fine. And then he had a couple uh, drug charges on him, possession of cocaine and marijuana. That's going to get him, really, four years for weed? Goodness, well, ten grand in five years in prison. So there you go, that's what we had for our court cases. So we're going to go ahead and call that an actual episode. I appreciate everybody watching. If you did like it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and notify. Y'all have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.